p.m. Eastern Standard Time. 18 Beluga brothers and sisters took the plunge. Total body immersion was the order of the day. <laughs> Air temperature was 38 degrees, water temperature 42 degrees, mild conditions by some people's standards. Why did we do this? Uh, who knows, some of us were there to see an idea to fruition, maybe to see who would be crazy enough to go through with it. Some of us had a notion of the potential for spiritual union. Some were curious, others drunk. Whatever the reason, at some point, the whole became larger than the sum of its parts. There was an energy of robust vitality. There was fire and fervency, warmth, zeal, passion. Walls came down, defenses were lowered. A brother and sisterhood and fellowship was born all through the simple act of a little shared experience and a little help from John Barleycorn. We all learned something. I learned once again that we are all human, passengers aboard the same boat. We do the best we can. Love is truly the most important thing. I'm astounded, a simple idea taken, added, unbounded human potential, and you have the Beluga Whale Club. What is it that we are? What do we become now? Maybe the honest, unencumbered act of simply being together once a year to share the unique and fundamentally painful experience of, in the words of Steve, Beluga Mother, Father Moore, total nut retraction. I think I already mentioned that phenomenon. Uh, there has been talk of holding routine gatherings, et cetera, et cetera. I think that's the part I'm not supposed to read. So, so here we are again, 19 years later, for the 19th year, no, and 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, is 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20